Are you concerned about coronavirus? In this video, we will show you the information that you need to be aware of as both a patient and as a practice. Coronavirus, or WNCOV, is a type of flu virus that is thought to have originated from the wet food markets of the Wuhan province in China. It is a strong form of the flu virus that can give symptoms such as upper respiratory tract infections like the flu, high fevers, breathing difficulties, and others that can put you at high risk of pneumonia or more. It is spread like most flu virus by contact with affected people. Spread can be prevented with good hand washing, quarantine with affected individuals like in China, and self-care at home unless further treatment is needed. Antibiotics do not work on the coronavirus. How can we prevent the spread of coronavirus? The World Health Organization has released supporting information to help. It is important to wash your hands with soap and water or an alcohol-based rub. Cover your nose and mouth when coughing or sneezing with a tissue or a fleeced elbow, i.e. padded clothing. Avoid close contact as best as possible with anyone with cold or flu symptoms and thoroughly cook meat and eggs. Additionally, it does also recommend using protection when working with live animals. Washing your hands regularly after coughing or sneezing or when caring for the sick, before and during preparing and cooking food, before eating and after using the toilet are highly important and one of the best ways of preventing the spread of the virus. When washing your hands, it is important to make sure you clean both the front and back and cover both sides with adequate soap. Do not forget to clean in between your fingers and under your fingernails. There are lots of videos on YouTube that will show you how to do this effectively. It is highly important to dispose of tissues appropriately. It is also important to avoid unprotected contact with sick people, particularly in crowded environments. For this reason, many patients may be surprised to get information not to attend their local practice if there are concerns that they may be affected by coronavirus. This advice is correct. If you are concerned, please see the links that have further information in terms of what to look for. Hope you found this video useful. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to contact us. And please do share this video as best as possible with others to help prevent the spread.